Guy here, hope you're having a great Sunday. There's a great movie that came out literally decades ago, and it's called Ordinary People, and in, in it, Judd Hirsch. Uh, there's Judd Hirsch is in it, Mary Tyler Moore is in it. Um, Judd Hirsch plays a therapist, and I think a, 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 an amazing portrayal of an incredible therapist. You should check it out. But there's... He he's just himself. He's so authentic. He's um, not trying to do uh, or force anything. And uh, I, I think what I'm talking about here is self trust and the 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 adage. You know, it's not what you know; it's who you are. And yes, I always preface what I'm saying in these videos that knowledge is important. Of course it is, it's crucial. But the aspect of believing in ourselves, uh, if you're a therapist or, or you're a coach, and not putting all your chips in uh, your knowledge. Uh, and I think there's a lack of belief in a lot of therapists and a lot of coaches that uh, they need to be something else. They need to uh, achieve some ideal. I mean, I certainly did when I started seeing clients. Um, I, I you got out of graduate school and you bring all this knowledge and energy and um, <laughs> like this, like I, I, like I thought I had to be my idea of a therapist and I, I, ne I neglected, I ne ignored who I was, the many facets of my being and, and didn't honor that. Self-trust, uh, creativity, instead, instead I was kind of moved and driven by needing, wanting to fix, wanting to help. Uh, all great things in a sense, but if those things are not conscious, uh, we begin to act unconsciously. And that's where uh, the inner work comes in, the importance of exploring our own fears, our own biases, so that, uh, not that we won't be, or one won't be triggered in a session, but that we will be able to manage, manage that and work through that. And for me, really, so much of this uh, comes down to understanding, really believing that we are enough. Our presence, our beingness is enough. It's going to be different, right? Each of, the, each of ours is going to be different. But in and of itself, being present, wanting to be there, understanding what uh, trauma does, how it impacts the brain and body neurobiologically and so forth. That is crucial. But along with that, understanding that the foundation, in my belief, the foundation of healing is forged with one person being present, trusting themselves with another person. And from that flows spontaneity, creativity, trusting in the unfolding and evolution of the healing journey. Those things, to me, are magical because they're beautiful. And they're, they're beautiful in their simplicity, but I believe that it, they require a certain... Uh, committed and diligent intentionality. Have an awesome Sunday.